this is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited tonight. I'm going for overall victory. I'm still going for overall victory number 1,164, coming off that very rough Get Chunky Cookie Challenge yesterday down in Fremantle. Well, we are still in the greater Perth, Western Australia area, just like all the challenge events we're doing. We've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. <laughs> Quite north of Perth, we are up in Alkamos, which also known as Alkamos Beach, but we're here at Foodie Boutique Perth. Big thank you to the owners. We've got Lou and then her teammate in this venture, Mr. Chef Buffalo. Thanks to them for having us in. Katina, we're right before me, but I am now hoping to become the second person, not to give away the results of hers, but uh, I do have to try to beat the record in order to get some sweet cash so I can buy her more presents. But I'm hoping to become the second person to dominate their 2.5 kilogram Big Conti Roll Challenge. Now, a Conti Roll is short for Continental Roll. It's, I guess, an Australian sandwich. We've got lots of people here laughing because of how I say Conti with my American accent, even though Americans don't have accents, you all do. But I've got just 45 minutes to finish everything here. Now, this 2.5 kilogram Conti Roll is right at that. It's like a 700 gram bread, freshly baked, on that is actually a sauce, which is like a combination of mustard and mayo. But then on this, we've got a whole bunch of meats, four different meats on the bottom. Uh, we've got a whole bunch of Hungarian salami. We've got mortadello, prosciutto, and then ham. So we've got two different layers of sliced cheddar cheese. And then we've got a whole bunch of mixed leaf lettuce. And then we've got artichokes on here. I know I can pronounce that. And then I keep on screwing up this thing. It is caponata, which is a plant based. Uh, it looks amazing. There's a whole bunch of that. But yeah, this is right around two and a half kilos or five and a half pounds. I've got 45 minutes. If I fail, it's going to be 75 Australian dollars. But if I do win, I'll get my entire Conti Roll meal for free. I will actually get 150 Australian dollars cash uh, and I'll be the second person with my name and photo up on the wall of fame. But if I do beat the record, uh, like I said, a Sheila that lives in Wisconsin now, she finished in 39 minutes and 37 seconds. So if I'm able to beat that, they're gonna double the prize money and I will get 300 Australian dollars. So without further ado, let's pull our hair back and get this challenge started. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so this is gonna be a challenge moving forward. You do have 45 minutes, but of course I'm trying to beat the 39, 37. Big thank you again to Lou and Chef Buffalo, and big thank you to everybody with Man Vs. Food Perth uh, for helping to get this set up as well. But whew, let's do it. One, two, three. Ooh. 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 All right. I don't even know what I'm gonna do. Let's have an artichoke just for some flavor. Oh yeah, okay. We're gonna do a little bit of meat and then try to eat this as a sandwich. This is annoying. <laughs> As you notice, I'm not very efficient so far, so I'm hoping to beat that. Yeah, I'm gonna try to eat this as a sandwich. We have so many people complain whenever I break stuff down and don't eat it like I should, so I'm trying to do all this for you. I've been excited for this uh, capicota or whatever. Um, ca caponata, yeah, carbonara. It's gonna help get all this bread down. You can't really see it, but I've got a lot of the uh, capicata. I'm trying not to be offensive. I'm trying to pronounce it right. I just have a lot going on. All right, 420 in. Blaze it, baby.
so much bread on this sandwich, but also there's a lot of meat, cheese, and toppings on here, and it is so good. I'm loving this uh, mustard and mayo sauce that Chef Buffalo had. Ooh, seven minutes in. This is so good, I'm just doing a lot of chewing. I actually have to shut up and eat on this one. <laughs> Under 10 minutes, 9.50 in. Thirteen oh eight in. This sandwich is so good. I'm loving eating it all as one, uh, having all this flavor on it. It's like I'm in Flavor Town, <laughs> but instead I'm in Alchemos doing a Conti roll. <laughs> Do they have soda here? Diet Pepsi or Diet no. Coke Zero or anything? You've got yuzu or mandarin or lemon or lime jalapeno. Mandarin was good. It really was good. What is that? It's delicious. I don't know, though. It's sparkling water, but with flavor. It's only 48 calories. It's diet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure all of these things mentioned are great by themselves. I'm just worried about them mixing with this sandwich. I didn't win before I began. I didn't get like a dark soda and bring it over here. I really want this money. I've got to see if he'll accept it. Did he say greater than or less than 20 minutes? Less or did he say less than? Less than 20 minutes. Oh, oh he is. In the grand scheme of things, I'm a jerk. Uh, because I finished in exactly 20 minutes, which I had 45 minutes, but I had to beat the record, which was 39, 37 by Katina. And obviously I did that, but then Jordan at the start said- I had a 20 minutes, Randy, I'll stick another 150 on top. Let's go. <laughs> that if I beat 20 minutes, he will add in $150. I haven't had anybody do that in forever, so I really wanted to do that. Oh, and I do know that I would have crushed the 20 minutes if I had a dark soda. Uh, I didn't win before I began beforehand, uh, but I did it in exactly 20 minutes. Uh, but yeah, I cannot say enough about how delicious uh, that entire thing was. And oh, wow, okay, they're bringing everything out now. Katina, my favorite uh, server, the only staff member right now that's not Brazilian. 
Uh, Lou and Chef Buffalo are both actually from Brazil. And wow, such good food. Uh, I'm looking at the refrigerators on the other side of the camera with all their takeaways, sandwiches, uh, wraps, and other stuff. They've got freshly baked bread. The bread on that Conti roll was not uh, made by them. It was locally sourced. But most of the other bread is all made by them. Everything seems fantastic. And as you see, they've got dessert as well. So before moving on, let me have a nice bite of this freshly made with love tiramisu. Ooh, look at that. Now I know why Katina finished all of hers, but I am not, I'm gonna enjoy some of mine after, so last bite. <laughs> For me, it was overall victory number 1,164. Uh, that's three events done now, I'm two and one in the Perth, Western Australia area. We've got one final one after a day off. Uh, we're going to Rottenest Island to see some creatures. Quokkas, yes, yes. But yeah, the day after that will be a massive 28 inch solo pizza challenge at Mac Daddy's in Mount Lolly, uh, which is closer to Perth. So that video will be next. Oh, if you like this video, be sure to watch either this one or this one. I know you like those as well because they're very similar. But either way, I'll catch you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Win before you begin. Yeah. Yeah.